Okay, so the video I guess that you saw yesterday was of me making this square, this little post-apocalyptic like um, town square. Uh, so then I went uh, about scanning it with this thing and while this is a really good room scanner, it's pretty low res for tiny little objects like this. But that means that it looks real cool. Like this tree right here, which is like lumps and things. And I like it like a lot. Um, except for now I forgot how to rotate. Ah! Just, how do I friggin' no help. Okay. I'm just gonna be embarrassingly ill-equipped to do this. Whoa! There goes my light. I know how to operate machinery. There we go. Um, how do you rotate? Are you doing it? Right click. That's zoom. Not when I do it. Oh, I was pushing the wrong button. Anyway, it's so like, here's this awesome thing. Okay, so scanned it, made a 3D model, stuck it in Unity. One of my favorite things about it currently is that there's this giant ladder right here, uh, which is like totes awesome. Um, <clears throat> so now we're going to make an art toy out of it, I guess. Like a tiny, tiny, the ti world's tiniest game. Probably not actually the world's tiniest game, but a tiny game. It'll be tiny. And you will click on shit, and then shit will happen. Yeah. Zoom, zoom. Um, let's go through this door, children. Hello, door. I like you as an object. And I want to go through you. Bam, 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 bam. Oh, and like up here, you can see that like it's really low resolution, so you can like kind of see the lady, and you can kind of see the door, and you can kind of see the nail salon window. But it's not totes clear, and this is like the pizza joint. With the, there's supposed to be like bars on the windows and like vines and crap growing everywhere and it's called crust and like all the you can sort of tell that there are like chairs on top of tables but you probably wouldn't be able to tell that if you didn't know that and this is supposed to be a pizza anyways uh, so yeah we are working on making this into the world's tiniest game and then seeing like how I don't know, I'm just trying to play with like how scanners plus 3D objects in the real world can be translated into 3D objects in the virtual world. Woo, virtual reality! End.